guys. John and Jock here for Balo Marine and again we're out on day two. Uh, it's a beautiful day out here, there's no wind, really sunny. Funnily enough it's winter and it's not cold. Uh, so today we wanted to try and go back through some of the footage that we lost on the exhaust riser video. Uh, so we're gonna show you what we did. I'm not gonna take the engine apart again because that's way too much effort. Um, and the boat's running really well at the moment. So we're gonna take it for a bit of a test run and we're gonna show you everything that we've done. And also I wanted to just take a couple of minutes to explain the cooling system on this boat because when I bought this boat, I had no experience with inboard motors. And so I had no idea what I was doing. So hopefully this video might teach someone something. It might not. Uh, but that's what we aim to do is to just try and give you a bit of advice and help everyone learn Give off our knowledge and hopefully get some knowledge back in the comments So if I do get anything wrong, please comment and also if you haven't seen us before, please like subscribe do all that fun stuff and uh, We can keep making videos. So thanks guys. Let's get to it. Yeah, fellas Okay guys, so this here is my heat exchanger, or that's actually the header tank. The heat exchanger is the coils that run through the middle, and that's where the seawater gets pumped through. And inside this tank has all the coolant in it. So the coolant gets cooled down by the, uh, the coils. So they've got the cold water from the sea running through them. The coolant runs in between those pipes, and that's what cools the coolant down. Now, I had to take this off because the exhaust also runs through down the bottom here and I had to change those gaskets because they were leaking and I was getting all smoke in the cabin. I also had to, to change this exhaust riser here so the piece of stainless steel pipe that goes from about here and joins onto my header tank down here if you can see that. So. That needed to be replaced because the old one was extremely rusty. Um, that also had a huge hole in it, more smoke coming into the cabin. Now, I've also changed the configuration of some of the hoses. This hose actually ran off under my seat and through this water tank, which I don't use. I've actually got to take this water tank out, but that's a job for another day. So now I've just got it coming straight out of the heat exchanger, straight into the exhaust. That way I haven't got all the pipes running around everywhere and I can take that tank out. So we've also, down here, we've got two oil coolers. So it's the same concept. We have a whole heap of little copper pipes that run through these coolers. The oil, as it gets hot, it comes into the shell. It doesn't mix with the water, but it comes through into the shell and it goes around the cool pipes and that cools the oil down and then it goes back into the motor or as my smaller one here, that does the gearbox oil. So that's just a bit of a run through of how a cooling system works on a boat. Basically it just sucks in the seawater runs through all these hoses, it cools down my gearbox oil, then my engine oil, then my coolant. And then the water just goes straight out of the uh, heat exchanger, into the exhaust, and out the back. It mixes with the gases and it cools the exhaust gases down as well. So, I hope that helps someone, anyone. Alright, thanks guys, let's take this baby for a run.
Okay, guys, well, now that I've dragged John away from his uh, scrolling addiction, he does have a bit of a problem. What can you do? Small he's, problem. He's from that generation. Yeah. Um, so we've taken it for a run. She went really, really well. Really happy with how it's progressing. Um, so hopefully there'll be no more videos on the motor for a little while and we can start getting some of the inside fixed up. Uh, but first, I just want to enjoy the boat for a while. So, all right. Well, thanks guys, thanks for tuning in, and again, if you did like the video, or you want to see more of him, then like, subscribe, share, do all sorts of things, just, uh, it really helps us out. So, thanks guys, see you in the next video. See you fellas, take care. You can go back to scrolling now. <laughs> I will.